Hello everyone, I hope you're having a fantastic day. In this video we are going to be now hitting all Elden Ring bosses in Even Plus with the craziest night build I have created so far. The Ethereal Knight is an insanely broken setup that features the most destructive properties available in this game, being the perfect choice for players that like to melt the bosses HP bars faster than a rocket. As the main weapon of this build, I chose the Flamberge, cause it is the great sword with the best dexterity scaling when using key affinity. Besides of having one of the longest range of the great sword class and a passive but more than decent bleed build up, I decided to use this weapon with the Stormblade Ash of War. It scales with the strength and dexterity depending on the affinity you choose, which means that if we use the heavy affinity, we will have a better strength scaling, and if we choose the keen affinity, we will have a better dexterity scaling. Therefore, for a weapon like the Flamberge that scales safe with dexterity when using keen affinity, and for a skill based on firing projectiles, dexterity will be the best option to get the max performance possible when using this combo. The Stormblade Ash of War is a really amazing skill that allows you to destroy your targets at a very fast rhythm at close or long range. The speed of this ability is the same of the R1 attacks of the Great Sword category, but it deals way more damage and looks a lot better. I fell in love with this build cause it's one of those hybrid setups that allow you to be effective in all possible scenarios, while being really easy to use as well. You can obtain both the weapon and skill very early on the game. The Flamberge is located at the Red Main Castle, guarded by a pumpkin head on Kaelid, and the Storm Blade can be bought from Bernal at the War Master Shack in Limgrave. I'm surprised of the amazing damage values we can deal with such a basic setup as this one. So versatile and powerful at the same time. First of all, I'm going to show you the build and then we will be the major boss of the game without taking a single hit. We are going to be using the Flamberge on plus 25 with the Stormblade Ash of War on the Keen Affinity, and we need the God Slayer Seal on plus 25 to boost the performance of our incantations and to cast our main buffs, but any seal with decent fade scaling will be fine. I'm gonna be using the Raging Wolf set cause I feel it fits this build really good, but be sure to choose the one of your preference. The best talismans we can pick for this build are the Ritual Sword Talisman, the Shard of Alexander, the Roaring Windsor Insignia and the Millicent's Prosthesis. However, if you want to boost the Black Flame or Blood Flame Blade, the Fire Scorpion Charm is a great option too. And if you want to get the most out of Electrify Armament, then you should try the Lightning Scorpion Charm. The thing is pretty similar with the Physic. We are going to be using the Thorny Crack Tear and depending on the situation, we can go with the Stombar Crack Tear, the Flame Shrouding Crack Tear or the Lightning Shrouding Crack Tear. The versatility of this build increases its potential dramatically. The stamina consumption of this build is moderate, but having some Pickle Turtle Legs ready is a very solid idea if you ask me. The most effective stats to unleash the power of this monster are Forion, Vigor and Endurance, we must level up Dexterity to 85 and Fate to 60, Golden Vow and Halop Shabriri are going to be our main buffs, Blood Flame Blade, Black Flame Blade and Electrify Armament are perfect weapon buffs for this one. Now that we have completed and optimized our build, what do you say if we begin with the boss fight? If you don't want to farm runes or materials for your Elden Ring builds, MMOEXP is the best web service where you can easily acquire as much runes and items as you wish for the best price. Use my code CARLOSEN to get a 5% discount on your purchases. Thanks MMOEXP for sponsoring today's video. Come on. Come on. Come on. Give it to me. Give it to me. Oh, <laughs> let's go. That's what I'm talking about, baby. <laughs> Come on. Oh, you're dirty. Come on. Take this. No, 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 my friend, no, my friend, you're not going anywhere, my friend, 14k damage, baby, <laughs> dude, we ran out of stamina before running out of FP, that's crazy, man, nah, you're crazy, ah, I just killed him, bro, oh, oh, Let's go, baby. Do your best, bro. Nah, that's not your best, but it's okay. Okay. Well, that's your best, bro. Definitely. Come on. Oh, this is amazing. Come on. Come on. Oh, nice! We did it, guys! Here it comes. That was close. You know, I don't like this. You're. That's the advantage of having some range, bro. Oh, that's a lot of damage. 
That's what I'm talking about, bro. <laughs> nice. <laughs> he was leaving already, bro. <laughs> no way. <laughs> What's up with you, homie? You are going too crazy with me. Oh. 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 <laughs> Come on. Let's do it. Oh. <laughs> Baby. Oh. Come on. Oh. Oh. No! <laughs> I love the weapon and the Ash of War. It's a good combo. Come on, Lorita. Hit. <laughs> Let's go, guys. Oh, my God. No. Oh, my God. Oh my god, that's... Wow. Come on. Nice guys, we did it bro, perfect guys. Okay, let me explain you the buff routine real quick. First of all, you use Golden Vow, then your Pickle Turtle Leg and your Weapon Buff. If your Weapon Buff is Black Flame Blade, you use it at the last moment because it doesn't last a lot. Now you use your Physic, now your Body Buff which will be Halusebrilio. And you refill your FP and you're ready to go. Okay, I'm dealing more damage this way. Come on! Come on! Let's go! <laughs> okay guys, just for the record, for this fight use the Lightning uh, Shrouding Crack Tear and your Electrify Armor. Nice. Nice. Mm. <laughs> Let's go, it was beautiful, bro. <laughs> hey there, man. Please behave. Please be decent with me. Come on. No way that worked, bro. <laughs> nice. That's what I'm talking about, guys. Let's go! <laughs> wow, this beat is really powerful, baby.
This time I won. This time I won. Let's go, guys. <laughs> Let's go, baby. This time I won. <laughs> hey there, bro. You are vibing right there. Oh my god. That's a lot of damage. Come on. What? <laughs> oh, the bleed proc, bro. <laughs> yeah, this weapon has a passive bleed effect. Is that amazing, guys? <laughs> Tail attack. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> nice, that's an intro clip, guys. Oh, you, you are, you are dairy, bro. Let's go, let's fight. Oh, it seems like you are not ready for me, bro. Yeah, run. That's the best you can do. Come on, bro. Keep running. Keep running. Keep running. <laughs> Keep running, bro. Wow, that was the safest Portisax fight. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go! No way, dude! No way!